character that can easily loop his ultimate if you use him right. A nameless knight that loves to play with his life on the line because it has something to do with his inside ladder. So I welcome you to a knight guide. Knight loves to steal a kill, so let's talk about his skills. The first attack card is called Justice. It is a one target skill, and this card is the card that will help your knight loop his ultimate as it restores an extra moxie if you manage to kill an enemy with this card. You want to have this card at the minimum of 2 star before using it, better if you can make it 3 star or just have 2 2 star copies of it. And make sure to always use it right after his ultimate and target the weakest mobs if any, because this way it will quote unquote secure his next ultimate in case you fail to fully kill the enemy. Now let's move to his second attack card, Glory. This card is a mass attack that hits two enemies, but I want you to remember that the 2 star version of this card doesn't have its damage increased. It only adds an effect where if he kills his enemy with this card, he will gain an extra moxie. Hence why Knight is a character that loves to kill still. His ultimate is a mass attack that targets all enemies. If you manage to kill an enemy with this skill, then your allies will be granted a one stock buff that increases their next damage by 50%. At P0 he would work just fine, but ideally he wants a P1 minimum for the flat 100% multiplayer increase on his ultimate. Beyond this is just a luxury. As for Resonate, try to get as much as damage bonus and attack. You can also try your luck with more crit chance, but since it rarely procs on mine, I just go for all damage bonus and attack. The reason why Knight loves to play with his life on the line is because of his insight. At inside 1, per X% percent HP lost by the target increases his damage dealt by 10%, and at inside 3, per X% percent HP lost by the enemy increases his penetration rate by 10%. I believe both have a similar meaning where the lower his HP is, the more damage he deals, so maybe it is just a translation thing. So what team that can support his skill still needs and lower HP experience? Personal my answer would be Kornbloom and Balloon Party. Kornbloom has a good debuffs and mass attack card that deals pretty good damage to help both Knights, Justice, and Glory cards. And Balloon Party heals based on HP loss, so it will keep Knights HP on the line. Balloon Party Ultimate also provides a one stack buff that can reduce damage taken and heal upon hit, so it might come in clutch. As for the best IQ, I heard that the best one for Knight is yet to come in the future, so you might want to save your Numa currency for that. The cheap temporary solution if you are running corn bloom in the team will be earning desire side cube as the best effect increases incantation damage and the unique effect increases the carrier's damage deal if the enemy is under stats down or negative status personally i'm using brave new world side cube for now because it increases his ultimate damage and after casting the ultimate the next incantation card damage will be increased so i'll be using this until his best side cube arrives in global